Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at the Jaded Toys Back to the Future 2 Time Machine. This, of course, is for ages 8 and up. It is completely die cast. I've already removed the screw at the bottom that holds it on, so whenever I rotate it around, you will see it move around a little bit before we open the box. So there's a nice look at the back of the box. Let's go ahead and scoot it back a little bit so you can see. Very nice look of the time machine. Uh, of course, this is a Hollywood, Hollywood Rides from Jada Toys. And there's the side. There's the other side. Now let's go ahead and open the box and take a look at the DeLorean time machine. And here we have it out of the box. And this looks really nice, guys. As you can see, it rolls really nice. The detail on this is amazing. You've got the uh, Mr. Fusion in the back here. Got nice, nice attention to detail. The tires are rubber. And as you can see, they glide really nice. There's a look at the back. Even got the license plate, pretty perfect. The barcode style license plate there. Here's a look at the other side. look at the front and as you can see this is does have the transparent windshield on it not the black windshield that most fans actually like uh, and the doors do not have any windows in them at all uh, you can put your finger in there there is no window to them or well no window glass plastic whatever you want to call it but the doors do open up just like the standard, the regular DeLorean time machine. All right, and now it's time for some comparisons. Here we have the Ecto-1 from the Jada Hollywood Rides, and mine's a little dusty, I have to clean it off. So I apologize for that. But as you can see, they're pretty much the same size. Just about. Uh, the Ecto-1, I feel, should have been made bigger. Uh, because obviously a DeLorean is not going to be the same size as a Cadillac hearse. <laughs> it just isn't. But, you know, they had to make it worth the price. Um, in fact, it looks like the DeLorean is much bigger than the uh, Ecto-1. Uh, at least the hood, anyway, as you can see here. Uh, it's a lot wider. Um, and it's actually lengthwise because of the boosters on the back it is about the same length but it is quite a bit wider and taller um, yeah I guess it's not so much taller it just kind of looks taller from the front so anyway there's that and now let's bring in a few other DeLoreans we got the Playmates DeLorean here we've got the Time Machine 2 from Hot Wheels and we've got the Hover conversion uh, DeLorean from Back to the Future 2 from the Jada uh, Minis. So there you have the Jada Hollywood Rides diecast DeLorean Time Machine from Back to the Future 2. Great addition to my DeLorean collection. I love Back to the Future. I love Back to the Future 2 and Back to the Future 3. The only improvement they could have made on this DeLorean is giving it the hover conversion that the Playmates toys, if I can get it, that the Playmates toys DeLorean time machine has. One of the wheels is stuck. It's not one to... There we go. Like that. That would have been nice. 
but I can understand they they want to do simplified. They have standard uh, bars, metal bars for the all the wheels of all their vehicles. So I can understand why they wouldn't have wanted to make something special for uh, hover conversion for the DeLorean. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I've been Shannon. This has been Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, go ahead and check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.